Thank you so much to the channel members that are supporting the channel. If you guys want to support the channel yourselves, you can start with as little as 99 cents a month. Hello, hello everyone. Welcome back to the channel. My name is Crafty Simmer and we are back with another episode of Cottage Living. Alrighty, welcome back everyone. So we are back with another episode and today we are just kind of well, I mean, so yesterday was Love Day, and today is actually going to be a festival. So the fate, so the Finchwick Chicken Fair is actually happening today. So that's really exciting. It looks like that once again, Reed ate something with meat. My bad. Oops. Well, actually, to be honest, he kind of picked it himself, not me. So I guess. I take no responsibility in it. But yeah, so basically Reed's kind of getting it's get it's it's getting getting closer to kind of getting to the end of his lifespan. And I mean I'm not really even sure if she'll be ready for it. I mean who knows? I mean like yeah, she has like Jason and everything now that she's been currently dating and kind of getting cozy with. We also have to work on the errands, but I totally forgot we had errands. I took on some errands from um from the creature keeper. So we are going to have to do that. So we can probably get some of this stuff easily. Um deliver a single serving. Okay, so apparently I have to give him some stuff that I don't even know how to make. So we're going to see what happens here. And then we have to converse with two rabbits. Which, I mean, should be fairly easy, so, I mean, yeah. Alrighty, so now that, did we get that walk and movement? Okay, we did. Alright, we're gonna take, we're gonna take our friend back home, and then we're probably gonna go and run around and do some of those errands that, that has been requested of us. Okay, we are probably gonna change out her outfit then. Um, dresser. Change outfit. She's going to change into this one. And hopefully that kind of resolves that problem. There we go. Now she's just too warmed up. Not like roasting. So that's better. But, oh, I freaking love. Yeah, so she's taking up a walk with her little buddy. And then I am probably going to get her to kind of, like, go around on her bike today. I mean, to be honest, Reed's kind of happy where he is. He's happier than a duck. Sitting at his garden, taking care of his garden, doing research on his garden, neither even. Like, that is just how happy he is with his entire, like, with just, like, his entire life around, around here. Not going to lie. That is basically his life. Uh, no, 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 no. We're done with the walk. We're done with the walk. We're going to actually discuss the danger of dust bunnies to this rabbit here. Because it is part of our chores. It's part of our errand running. And plus, too, we could also get some swag. Some free swag. So, you know. Jay, it's not today, honey bunny. Maybe we'll see you at the fair tonight. Oh, maybe they have to be two separate lot rabbits. We're gonna... Oh, there's no more rabbits in there. Okay. Well, I mean, I guess we could collect some cocoa berries. And then we can go down there. But Oh, right. We can put... Ooh, okay. We're gonna put um, salsa into, a... into that. We got a bunch of other things to do, too. Like, there's just so much to do. Okay, uh, and then we're gonna dress up Misty. Like, I think these are just the dang... Uh, look! Oh, it's so cute! Alright, how about you, buddy? I would now call you the uh, Canadian rooster. Because those look like... Uh, those look like maple leaves on your, uh, on your scarf, and you look absolutely adorable! 
There we go. I love it. I think they're all so adorable. Okay. So now we do actually have to start heading out and starting to hunt down the things that we need. So he wants us to get three cocoa berries. So the cocoa berries, I'm pretty sure they spawn kind of closer to these ruins. And we can also find, we also tend to find like a bunch of foxes here too. Uh, I just kind of wish there was like an easier way to kind of find these things. Cocoa bear. Okay, we're gonna harvest all. We're gonna go grab the cocoa berries. Everyone's wearing their cute little outfits. I freaking love it. Ah, it's so cute. Okay. <laughs> like they are adorable. Okay, bye, friends. But yeah, so that's basically kind of the plan, though, is that we are going to do the Finchwick Fair, and we are going to also, as well, kind of do, kind of run the errands that we were assigned to the Keeper. And this bike really does help get us around. Like, it is such a helpful little tool to have. And once again, it is just to die for. I think it is so adorable. So what do I even need to do for the Parmesan? Because, like, I've never really, I mean, I mean, like, I know there's, like, a bunch of new recipes in this, um, in this expansion. I just don't know how to do any of them. <laughs> mm, yeah. So, anyways, though, she is going to do her little ride up here, and where is he going? I mean, I guess I can... I mean, it won't be hard to find him again. I know. I know it won't be hard to find him again. Yes. I mean, she better like gardening. Considering, you know, that's basically all she does. Is garden. Okay, uh, we're going to go ahead... We are going to hand in our, our mash. Where can I get the mash? Deliver three cocoa berries. Okay. Go get your cocoa berries. Deliver them to the creature keeper. And then there should be rabbits over there as well. So we are going to make sure that we do talk to everything that we can. That's not the festival that we're going to tonight. Bravo. Oh, look at that. There's the fair. So we are going to go to the fair today. That is kind of the plan. But first of all, picture. And what is this about show fair information? So we have a chicken and an egg competition. All right, well, we do, well, we have an excellent egg to enter. And then just to kind of top it off, we are going to converse with this rabbit, discuss the danger of dust bunnies. <laughs> and then he should probably give us like a mash. And then we're going to head back over here. And he's going to get that to open again. We're going to take our green egg. And I guess that's it. Oh, I guess we can also like harvest all the crops too. So I'm going to let him do that and harvest everything. And then I guess we can go and give him a rabbit report while we're while we're kind of waiting for that to kind of happen. Friendly. Oh, I found. I just saw it. Uh, where is it? Give rabbit report. There you go. Go do that. We'll probably have to move those crops somewhere a little bit better. Um, we, but we are going to grow some lettuce, more pumpkins, and watermelon this time around. 
And then he's going to plant... This part doesn't take very long, so I'm sure that, like, we can just go ahead, plant all of them like that. Why are you giving... What? Why are you flirting with him? I thought you didn't like him. Okay, Tyria. We're just gonna let him finish up his planting, and then we can call it a day, and we're gonna go to the... to the fair. And we are back! Okay, so we are now at the fair, at the green... at, at the Fink Witch Fair. So we gotta go... I mean... Madame, please open up your store. Thank you very much. I would like to partake in your store. Because we actually do get 10% more profit when we come here. Like, look at this place. And then he's going to go and take a set. <laughs> and then we're going to see what she has here. We're going to be... We're going to buy... I guess we're going to see what she has for sale. Okay. Cool. Let's see here. Do you have anything for me? I mean, I might just have to move those... Uh... Oh, you do have a spicy mushroom in your, in your possession. Okay, I'll take that. And then we can actually sell more... So, like, I can actually sell more by vibe in here. Um, I mean, I guess it's not that much of a big difference. But, I mean, it does go a long way if you have multiple items to sell, you know? Okay, so now what we're going to have to do is that we are going to head over back over to where the fair is. And then we're going to... Oh, apparently I need to put a chicken in my inventory? Tea? Okay. Uh, we're... But we are going to submit an egg entry, though. We do, in fact, have an egg in our possession. So we are going to do the egg. Put the egg in the... Put the egg on on display and she is going to view her competition entry oh. i mean this is an excellent egg like it's like it's in excellent quality i mean is there anything else she can do actions she's going to admire this black hen not even sure who it belongs to but she is going to admire it But yeah, like this is now, like but now we're at the fair, and you, and and like I mean, like it changes like every week. Oh, we can also sell some of the crops that we have for just a wee bit more profit. Not a lot more profit, just a wee bit more profit. And then I think he also has learned some other things as well. So we will have to do that as well. And I also kind of want to make a personal mission to see if I can find Agnes and kind of tip her off. Like, not gonna lie, I kind of want to just, like, I kind of want to see if, like, if Agnes is here, I want to cause some problems, you know? Like, I want her to, like, hit me with her purse. I don't even know where she is, but... I do want her... This egg looks super smooth. Nice color and shape. I bet it could win. Yeah, it better win. I mean, that's my egg. My egg is amazing. Oh, what a sweet little boy. Oh, but he's so tense. Everyone's looking at my egg. Oh, there's two different eggs now. Where's my egg? I think this is my egg. Yes, that is my egg. 
Yeah, I have this in the bag. I mean, look at that quality! My quality is amazing! Oh, fine. You get a single dollar. And then this is a white rooster. Once nothing really impressive over here. What's this? Oh, this is like a big this is like another place where you can plant fertilizer and stuff. Which we do actually have to do. We have to now actually fertilize things. At some point. <laughs> Um, so we're going to compliment his fair entry just to kind of make him feel better. I mean, he, I mean, he seems kind of upset. I mean, he is just a kid. So we are going to kind of cheer him up about his little entry. Make him feel better about it. I mean, it really is nothing to go home about. But I do want to try, but where is Agnes? Like, don't tell me she's already dead. Like, if she's dead, that's gonna really suck. <laughs> like, if she's already dead, that's gonna suck. We are going to invite Jace to come over, though. Jace to come and, come and hang out with us. While we're kind of doing this. I mean, like, it really is nothing special. I mean, like, yeah, it says, like, you can buy special items and stuff. But I haven't been able to figure out exactly where to buy those special items. That they, that, that, like, it says to have. I don't know. Maybe I'm just stupid. I mean, that wouldn't surprise me. If I'm not just, if I'm just not that bright. But. Yeah. <laughs> That's kind of where we're at right now, though. I don't know. I just don't know. So, waiting for Jace to come by. There he is. Hello there, Jace. We are going to go ahead and give him, like, a good, like, a quick little kiss. Give him a nice little kiss. It's fine. Everything is fine. Oh, look at how sweet that was. We're gonna do a suave kiss now. Oh, he hates him. Oh, that's spicy. That is so spicy. Like, ooh, dad does not approve of the boyfriend. <laughs> dad does not approve of the boyfriend of the new boy toy. Mm -mm, not his cup of tea. MC dresser, change outfit, because now she's getting cold. Um, she's gonna whisper to him seductively. You like her. Don't do that, Jace. Sims are looking for love tonight. Um, we're gonna ask about his day. But yeah, like, like he definitely does not seem to be a fan of of uh of him. So I kind of find that interesting. I really do find that interesting that like she was not a fan of it whatsoever. So yeah, so basically, like right now, all we're doing is that we're kind of waiting. Um, I'm gonna reopen up this, this, and then, like, I'm not, yeah, so it's, it's about to end in, like, an hour, so, we just gotta vibe here for about another hour, see what happens. I am really trying to find that rumple bottom. But I'm beginning to think that crumple bottom's not here. I'm beginning to worry about Crumple Bottom's uh Crumple Bottom Crumple Bottom's existence. I am starting to worry. Very much starting to worry. So there is that. 
TV. You don't have to go pee. You don't have to go eat. You don't. You don't even need to take a shower. Me just not caring anymore. <laughs> it's fine. Everything is fine. It's it's why I can't even play this game without like without like the mods or anything. Because if I don't, then I struggle and it sucks. Okay, so now, where is the mayor? I do kind of want to see what she's thinking. Can I maybe... Is he old? No, okay, never mind. Festival, finish up, any activities, come back. Be sure to come back. Yeah, I'm not quite sure what the competitions do. So, you know, it's a thing. It's a thing. There's Agnes! Oh man! I kind of wish you were here earlier. I would have loved to be beaten by... I would have loved for you to have beaten me with your purse, Agnes. Okay. Well, I mean, anyways, other guys, thank you guys so, so, so much for watching. I think I, I don't even know how these... I, I, I don't even know how these fairs work. I just show up to them. <laughs> anyways, if you guys enjoyed this part, don't forget to leave a thumbs up as well as a comment. This place is just beautiful to have a proposal. I'm sorry, I'm thinking ahead. Um, and all that fun stuff. Anyways, if you guys... <laughs> Let me try this outro again. If you guys enjoyed this part, don't forget to leave a comment as well as a thumbs up. It really does help out the channel when you do that and interact with my videos. And if you have not yet... Wow, it's so neat. Uh, that child is so rude! Um, and if you have not yet joined the Crafty Squad, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Anyways, I'll see you all next time. <laughs> Bye there, guys.